Hey, good morning everybody. How's it going? Red Eyed Jedi here and welcome to Flare Daily. Please like, share, and subscribe to get more great crypto content. Now, before I go off, this right here is my direct me forward slash red eyed Jedi page. Um it has most of the links to um my stuff. Go ahead, check them out. Uh, I do have other things. I haven't done anything for a moment, but like this one right here is for gaming, uh, which on Twitch I also do. But I might also bring a flare news to to Twitch because I've noticed if you if you don't know, you could follow. Uh, I think it's Ripple X Dev, which is one of the guys um, from Ripple developer. And he goes over a bunch of things like how to create your own token on the XRP ledger. So I was just checking it out. Um, we'll talk more on that some other time. I uh, don't have tons of flare news today. Sorry about that. But I have some Bitcoin news, which might be good for alt season. And I got some casino coin information as well. And then at the end, I have just a little fun Thing that um I, I want to show anyways so let's get started right now as of recording the flare token is down 4.35 percent to right now it's trading at one dollar and 86 cents with a 24 hour high of two dollars and 13 cents and a 24 hour low of a dollar 75 so it's this nice little wave keeps going up and down around that two dollar mark um, which is good. And remember, this is the Flare IOU on BitTrue. The actual token is not yet released. It will come out when the Flare network is launched, which is going to be towards the end of June, beginning of July. Fingers crossed. Next, we got XRP, which right now it is at $1.33. Down 5 point thirty seven percent with a twenty four hour high of a dollar forty one and a twenty four hour low of a dollar twenty five it's okay that just means you have more time to buy like these to me these prices are still higher than what I'd want to see because I want to keep investing and I liked it when it was down there at the at the thirty cent range because I could pick up a lot cheap um but I'm okay with it being the dollar thirty-three because it just means it has more value now, right? And soon it's gonna explode, and we're gonna talk about that here in a little bit. Right here we got Doge. Who it has dropped seven point thirty-seven percent to twenty-eight cents with a twenty-four hour high of thirty-three cents and a twenty-four hour low of twenty-three. If you were one of those people that bought into Doge and then pulled out to go because of the drop, you know, you should never do that. If you're losing money, might as well just hold on to it because you know what? It's just on a downward trend and then it goes back up. And it, when it goes up, it's going to go up even higher. So got to have those, uh, like uh, Crypto Mammy says, those diamond fingers, hold on tight. Don't spend. Don't be a day trader unless you know what you're doing. Other than that, I would suggest, and I've learned my lesson the hard way, um, I would suggest just holding. Buy and hold. Know what you own. And that's it. Um, <laughs> and then let's jump over to Casino Coin, which um, right now you cannot buy. If you do own Casino Coin, I suggest doing the swap. You have until June 18th um, to complete the swap. Mine just got put through today. I'll show you that in a moment. Um, but this right here is CasinoCoin.info, which is a very great page if you want some uh, Casino Coin information that you can't find anywhere else. Um, so right here, like I said, swap of old casino coin to new casino coin is now live if you are a current holder of old csc you should perform the swap to the new csc running the xrpl in order 
to continue holding a valid CSC investment. The swap process is documented at the official Casino Coin How to Swap page. You have until the 18th of June 2021 to complete the swap process. And so right now there is 1401 accounts with Casino Coin. Mine is one of them. Um, you got this many Casino Coin enabled accounts. Casino Coin distributed to holders 13.5. 51 billion nice you know and i was talking to uh ken 88 over in uh, the flare finance discord and you know we were discussing you know casino coin a little bit and man i kick myself in the butt all the time because i was there in the discord when i saw like a the big fallout between daniel and everyone else and i wasn't sure what was going to happen and I was for sticking with Daniel, but I didn't know if how things really worked at the time. Um, so I fumbled out and sold my supply. And then when I realized, okay, you know what? I'm just being an idiot. I believe in Casino Coin. I have all this time. Go back in it. I did, but the value apparently had gone up enough to where I only got to buy 10% of what I originally held. So that is just a, sh a little story to tell you. Hold your crypto assets. Don't be a day trader. Don't uh, fall for the FUD or the FOMO. Just know what you're, you're buying into and hold. All right. So this is really cool. Um, the price chart right here shows you where everything is. So this was the beginning. Um, well, actually, right here is the beginning of the swap. And all of a sudden, you see the spike here because everyone was buying what they can before, um, you know, they do the swap. And then it dropped a little bit. So it was up here at eight cents, a little above eight cents. And then now it's down here at, um, it's not even eight cents, it's 0 0.008. So now it's 0 0.005, meaning you can get a good buttload if it was um, before you trade. So, oh. Good luck. You can't even find it anymore. Um, now that I think about it, because I did go in the Discord last night to see if there was any way to buy the token there, because I know that people do trading. But yeah, good luck. And plus, I already did my swap, so there's no getting any more for me. But check this out: CasinoCoin.info. Now with some Coin Telegraph news: Bitcoin dominance is about to drop below 50% for the first time in three years. A weakening Bitcoin presence could give altcoins the moonshot they have waited for for three years. Three years. So, Bitcoin. Coin revisited recent lows near $52,000 on Thursday as sustained weaknesses continued for the largest cryptocurrency. And that is a huge drop. And I, I've been stating this, and I, I know no one's going to listen to me when it comes to Bitcoin because I am not a, a fan of Bitcoin at all. Like, I appreciate, you know, what you did at the beginning, but you're done. Goodbye. <laughs> um, so I always suggest getting out, selling your Bitcoin you know, into something that is more viable, you know, dump it into XRP, XLM, um, go buy your Doji coin. <laughs> I'm sure if you have Bitcoin, you don't like Doge. Um, but, you know, there are so many great projects out there that I would suggest putting money in. And like I was saying, there's a lot of brand new crypto utility being built and there's all these coins you can pick up now but you have to make sure that they're the good ones right and of course most of these are um buy it and hold because the value is going to go up i if, don't listen to anyone's bs on the fud because you know how much crap people talked about xrp when it was at 11 cents at 17 cents 18 cents 30 cents you know now they don't talk crap as much but they still do Anyways, good, good news. Because of the dominance dropping, that is good news for the alt season. 
Now over here on Twitter, BankXRP posted this, and I thought it was great. It says, old school Ripple Labs art. The XRP, faster than a streak of lightning in the sky, swifter than the speed of the light itself, fleeter than the rapidity, rapidity, yeah, rapidity of thought, R is Ripple, reincarnation of the winged Mercury. His speed is the dismay of scientists, the joy of the oppressed, and the open-mouthed wonder of the multitudes. Join the Global Settlement Network, which is pretty cool. I like that. That is cool. Um, so jump down here. This is Daniel underscore WWF. He is the guy. He is the uh, the director, right? As you can see right here, at Eminence Ltd. and Fund Limited. Um, and he does everything there is to do with Casino Coin. Like he's saved casino coin so right here it says getting a lot of questions about the kyc process of the csc swap and estimated clearance and status updates it is currently impossible for me to read any of my messages and reply in an adequate way as i will be immediately flooded with new messages sorry for that a thread and then just check out his thread on twitter and it goes down about the the, the kyc and all the processes of them uh, Authorizing the payment, making sure everything's legit because they want to make sure this is legit money going in. He wants to know where it's, the money's coming from, you know. It's a security thing, you know, and I, I understand everything he's doing. It's cool. Um, and this over here is in the Discord for Casino Coin. Um, and this is their swap instructions. Um, and, it, you know, so I would say check it out. Um, pause the video if you want to go ahead and read this. I'm not going to read it. Um, I just wanted to show this to you this is my screenshot and then I did post a casino coin swap information video yesterday I put the link on Twitter and it is also here on YouTube um, or if you see me on rumble or Facebook yeah look on Twitter <laughs> um, but anyways yes so the casino coin swap video is there check it out if you own casino coin this will help you um it has helped a lot of people which you know is cool i like helping as many people as i can uh this right here is just showing you that this morning when i got up i looked at my phone and right here it says casino coin swap your swap is successfully completed so if you don't know what i'm talking about in my video for casino coin at the end um you're going to go through the KYC, which is submitting your driver's license and taking a selfie. There is no trying to take a selfie of a photo. If it doesn't look like you, if your ID don't look like you, I don't know. You got to take that up with Casino Coin or Zoom or whoever. Like, I don't know why you wouldn't be able to pass a KYC. Um, but if you need help, there are there are places that you can go. Now over here, this is CasinoCoin.im, uh, which is another good site to go to. Now this right here is their new slogan, Against All Odds. Um, you know, just stating that they were in trouble. They were going away because of just the fighting in the background. And Daniel said, enough with the bullshit, and grabbed the reins, took over. And, dude... I appreciate everything he's done. Uh, and this right here to show you for end users, XRP, Casino Coin is powered by the XRP ledger and gives users unmatched transaction costs, speed, and security with near instant deposits and withdrawals, costing a small fraction over other crypto or uh, traditional fiat methods. Um, so check this out. This has a lot of cool information as far as what is Casino Coin. Gives you more information as to what everything they do. Um, I'm probably going to make another video that's just on Casino Coin to talk about it to give you more info. But if you want to check it out, it's CasinoCoin.im. Now, time for a couple of things I just wanted to share. Last night, I was on uh, the Discords checking out things, you know, for Casino Coin and checking in on Flare Finance because I do that from time to time. And I went in the rain chat. 
you know, dropping some XRP and Doge and just saying what's up to everyone and talking. Um, and then I had decided, well, I want to go and check out our old Discord. I do that still from time to time as well. So I went to the private beta Discord and I came across this. So I decided to look at, in the general, the very first message that was ever posted, which happened to be on December 30th, 2020 at 9.45 p.m. my time. Uh, which is from Crypto Frenchie. Welcome here and congratulations. So, very cool. Um, you got Indigo right here. You know, super thankful to be here. You know, <laughs> like this is the beginning of Indigo's long, long career <laughs> of, uh, of uh, Flare Finance. But yeah, very, very cool. It was very funny. And then I got... um. This right here, just scrolling through. So this is when I jumped in, you know, so December 31st. So New Year's Eve, uh, 2020 at 9.08 a.m. Maybe I can make all this into an NFT and get rich. <laughs> um, and then right here, I thought I'd just show this to all of you too. Mickey B. Fresh. This is him jumping in on, a, this is his first post right here in general which was excited to be included to have the opportunity to participate in beta testing DeFi products. Um, yeah. And so they, you know, great to be great to have you here, Mickey. Uh, and he's still here hanging out, which is awesome. Um, but it was cool just going in and just seeing how things were at the beginning, where everyone was at the beginning. Um, and then where everyone is now, you know, which is crazy. Um, so that was just it. It was just, you know, a small little look back at just a few little messages, screenshots, whatever, um, of the of our original Discord. And this is in the private, so none of you can see it if you're not in private. <laughs> but this is cool. Like, um, I don't know. It's kind of like a, a home away from home kind of thing because, you know, we spent a lot of time in the Discord, a lot of talking a lot of hanging out getting to know the whole crew um there's so many different projects now everyone's trying to do with crypto which is amazing um and i hope you know that i can interview a bunch of these guys i did talk to uh ken 88 which um we're gonna eventually connect and do a a, a video talking to each other about some random stuff i guess and then I also need to talk to Deep Space Flare so we can get a video going. Um, and anyone else out there in our Flare community, you want to hit me up for interviews and stuff? Hey, hit me up. I mean, it'd be fun. Talk to everyone about everything. Everything. <laughs> All right, everyone. Well, that was enough of my rambling. Um, there was, I hope, you know, you enjoyed this video. So please like, share, and subscribe. This is Red Eye Jedi, and this is Flare Daily. Thank you, and have a great day.